Hello everyone, this is Paul from Rando Tech Info. Today's video is about CDMA versus GSM networks, uh, specifically for people who live in the U.S. If you do not live in the U.S., you probably will not find this video particularly helpful. Uh, but if you do live in the U.S. and you're wondering if a device, a cellular device, a phone, or whatnot will work if you bring it over into the U.S., uh, hopefully you will find this video helpful. Uh, so, brief explanation. If you want a more detailed explanation, hit the YouTube. There's tons of, uh, of uh, explanations for this out there. But the quick version is, CDMA networks are used in the U.S. by Verizon and Sprint. If you are on one of those two networks, uh, you probably cannot bring in a device from another country and use it, uh, use the cellular networks uh, that you have here in the U.S. Uh, CDMA is typically only used in the U.S. and Canada, and uh, some, some parts of Japan, so phones from other parts of the world will not work here. Now, if you are an AT&T or T-Mobile customer, then your cellular network is known as a GSM network. And GSM uh, phones that run on those networks, those networks are using about 80% of the world. And there is a chance that it will work uh, on AT&T or T-Mobile if you bring them over into the U.S. Now, you won't know for sure until you check the frequency bands that that device utilizes. So different devices use different frequency bands. And uh, T-Mobile and AT&T also use very specific frequency bands in the U.S. So the phone has to be designed to use the same frequency bands that is used that are used by your carrier. So... If you are interested in bringing a specific device over into the U.S. Uh, to use from another part of the world or an international version of a device, uh, check and make sure that the bands supported by the device are supported by your network. And if there's a specific device that you want to know about, please feel free to drop me a line in the comments and uh, I will research that for you and I will make a video letting you know uh, whether that's a phone you can use here or not. So, um, that's all I have for today. Uh, if you like this video, please feel free to give me a thumbs up. And if you're interested in more content like this, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Uh, I will be posting more videos in the future. Until then, this is Paul from Rando Tech Info, signing out.